imam must be considerate of the elderly. That does not mean he must read alif, ba, ta, tha and go down. No. Some people think because the Prophet says, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the Imam must be considerate. So every rak'ah must be, Inna ta'ina kal kawthar, fasalli li rabbika wanha, Inna shani aka huwa al-abtar, Allahu Akbar, because I'm considerate of the old people, I'm reading Inna ta'ina. No. That is a wrong interpretation. Look at the sunnah recitations, the sunnah recitals of all the salah. Fajr is meant to be slightly longer. Zohar is meant to be a long salah. Maghrib is a short salah. Isha is a slightly longer salah. Which means if you cannot cope because you are old, get a chair and sit. But do not let people cut down on the sunnah. Wallahi, the benefit of prayer is huge. It is so big that you won't believe it does for you. It brings about calmness. When you can go into the prostration position known as sajda, for the sake of Allah, and you can declare his praise in that position and remain in there with a beautiful feeling. You see how you feel when you get up. You feel like Allah is yours and you belong to Allah. And that is the case. You feel so good. When we feel far from Allah, it's because we are the ones who've distanced ourselves. We don't want to read one line a day. I told you one line of the Quran a day, one line. It's no one can say that that's too much.